when you read in Proverbs 31, when the Bible was talking about a virtuous woman, eh? Proverbs 31, go read it. Bible was talking about a virtuous woman, Proverbs 31. He talked about her husband. He said, her husband shall be greeted by the elders on the gate. He said, virtuous woman is very happy seeing her. That's why a woman can give everything to support a man to rise. But some of them men, they don't know, they don't know you. They don't know you. So what? They don't know you. A woman can sacrifice her father's word for her husband. She can even, she can. Even, that's a woman who is a daughter of a millionaire can go marry somebody who is a wheelbarrow pusher. What do you think she's doing? To change the man's life. And the painful aspect of it that these men, by the time they get up, they will forget these women. By the time they immediately they get up. They look around, they say, me and this woman, we, 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 we are not mates, we don't match. But when, when, when they were like boga fish, the man, you know, some of them will not greet me again after today. They know I'm saying it's true, I'm saying it right. Whether you greet me, you don't greet me, no problem, no problem at all. If a woman stood by you when you were not in, never you in life forget that woman tomorrow, tell you the truth. She sacrificed so much for you. By the time God heard a prayer, because do you know that the woman prays more than the men? That's why they go to church more than men. Check all women here. All their prayer. God bless my children. God bless my husband. They, sometimes they don't even pray for themselves. 